Welcome to Spotlight Sunday. We're going to talk about this very famous guy that you're about to see right now, Christopher Columbus. He was an explorer, or an Italian, esploratore. Uh, there's said that he was born in Genoa, Italy. However, there is a controversy that basically states that um, he might have been born uh, in Portugal that he might have been a Portuguese nobleman who adopted the name when he moved to Spain. And there is uh, possibly DNA from a skeleton that just might prove it. And I gathered that fact from Forbes. You could also find out many fun facts and other fun facts about Christopher Columbus from the History Channel, um, which is actually quite strikingly very interesting. Um, but getting into Columbus and learning a little bit about him, uh, we do know, um, without uh, you know any other facts proven aside, is that he was born in Genoa, Italy in 1451. Uh, he died in Spain, May 20th, 1506. He had multiple siblings. Um, and the truth is, is that he did not discover America uh, in schools and today and even in the past, you know, growing up. They taught us that Columbus discovered America, which is false. It is, it is not true. Um, there's talks that Leif Erikson or Amerigo Vespucci um, discovered America and Amerigo, America, you know, it kind of goes hand in hand, you know, but again, it's all, um, it's all up for debate. Uh, but he and his crew came in three ships. Uh, they were called the Nina, the Pinta, and the Santa Maria, and they made four trips uh, to the Caribbean. Um, and he died in poverty in 1506. But every time that he went to uh, search. Uh, he basically searched for pearls, stones, gold, silver, spices, and other merchandise. And he would trade, um, you know, every time that he went to different locations, he would just basically trade and they would barter. Um, but yeah, with his impact, uh, he helped shape colonization. And thanks to him, uh, we have, uh, you know, and in history, we basically have several cities, rivers, and landmarks that are named after Christopher Columbus. So thank you. The spotlight is on Christopher Columbus for his massive contributions and historical value. Uh, so let's shine that light on him. Thank you, Christopher Columbus. We appreciate all your uh, findings and all your history. Um, so hopefully this was a fun little lesson. Uh, hopefully you learned a new word um, in Italian, explorer, esploratore. And uh, I do hope to see you in the next few videos. Thanks for dropping by. All the best now. Take care, fam. Bye.